Hello, welcome back to Bully episode 25. Um, I'm joined together with that the one, squeaky. the one, the beautiful Miss Ella. I apologize. I, last episode, I could not remember her name. It's Eunice. And fun fact, I she's googled a big it. Fan. She's big voiced fan. by a dude. And that's your fun fact of the day. Um. So Ella, I have a question. I'm terrified. You should be. Um. If I was a part of a clique for a school. <sighs> You're going to ask me that? Yeah. Which clique do you oh think I belong God. to? No matter what answer I give, a part of you is going to be offended. Why? Because if I say jock, you're going to be like, I'm a douchebag, blah, 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 blah. And then if I say nerd, you're going to be like, but I don't look like a nerd. And I was friends with everybody. And, 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 and I, I was on everybody's side. And blah, 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 blah. So there's just no right answer. I'm going to go with the Glee Club. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> I'm totally, I'm totally kidding. Um, I don't know, because I was not really in a clique either. Like, I, I mean, was, you were a theater kid. No, I wasn't. Yeah, you were a theater no, kid. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. No, you I wasn't. were a theater kid. No, I wasn't. Yeah. Were you there, sir? I don't think so. You told me. No, I was, I did theater, but I wasn't, like, friends with all the theater kids. And I barely got parts, okay? I was just scraping by. They were like, oh, we really need someone else, and we can't pick any of our... We need someone to play a tree. Hey, Ella. <laughs> Sometimes it'd be like that. Genji? Shut up. Also, I did everything, not just acting, okay? I made the programs, okay? I did it in design. I came in on winter break, and I printed them all and stapled them and got them right. We got ads from the community. They even threw a little money my way at the end to thank me. Oh. Mm -hmm. And much? I did all the portraits for like 150 bucks. 150 bucks? Hell yeah, Target gift card. And uh, then to make it, you know, not like a child labor or whatever, you know. It's more like a thank you gift. And then um, I did the portraits for the program. Um, helped build the set. I did... I did crew for the musicals so because i can't sing good so <laughs> i did crew and i ran over this guy with stairs one time because it was in the dark and we had to get the stairs off the stage and i didn't see him and i just went right over him and i i then he had to like burst into song right when the lights came on and he was like i just ran him over with a set of stairs <laughs> anyway it was you're so mean. I apologize. It wasn't on purpose. He wasn't supposed to be standing. This is what blocking is for, okay? It's a very delicate balance. One time, my friend was supposed to move this, like, desk off of off stage, and she didn't do it in time, so she had to climb into the cabinet and stay in there through the whole scene. She was stuck on stage. <laughs> That's kind of awesome, though. It's kind of awesome. Because the whole time you're sitting there going like, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. So funny. Or the time that we were doing a Halloween show at the community theater. I was doing crew and a bat flew in. It got in the back door because someone opened it for fresh air. And then you just got to like act around it. Literally, it was flying into the person's hair on stage while she was singing this crazy Halloween song, which is people in the audience thought it was like fake or something. But then the second the song was over, I had to like usher the whole audience out of the building. And it was a Sunday. We couldn't get a hold of animal control. We couldn't get a hold of anything. And we had this like big pool net. And me and my friend Faith were trying to catch this bat and get it outside. But it had gone into the roof, like the ceiling tiles and stuff. So it was traveling around the theater. It was crazy. Yeah. But I wasn't like singing in the hallways and trying to get, you know, I wasn't that kind of theater kid. Cool. I don't want to go in. Go in, go in, go in. I don't want to. Guys, Tyler never goes to haunted houses with me. It's not even that. This is our chance. The clown. Ooh, but this looks cool though. It's like swallowing us. Whoa. There's probably a lot of okay. jokes here, but I'm not going to tell any of them. Ooh, the uvula. Esophagus. The dangly thing that swings in the back of your throat. <laughs> I have so many years ahead. Oh, man. Oh. Wait, this is actually really cool. 
Well, we came here to fight. You really gonna say I'm a theater kid? If anything, I was a. Look how much you just talked nerd. about theater. I was telling you the good stories that made us seem fun. I wasn't like annoying. I feel like if you tell them I'm a theater kid, they're gonna picture this person in their mind that's not me. Um. And you are, were, uh, I don't know, just the dude sitting in the back of the class. Me? Yeah. I don't know. That's how you really feel about me? You're not a nerd, because it wasn't like you were, like, like, if we're looking at the stereotypes in this game, you weren't any of these. Probably yeah. you were Jimmy or you were, like, a greaser, but on the inside you weren't, but on the outside you were acting like one. Boom, I found it. I found it. I found it. I was Jimmy. You were a greaser. I was a greaser. But you were putting on a front. You had a heart of gold and whatnot. But the outside... This is of you now, not of high school Tyler. High oh. school Tyler, I can't really... Um, We don't need to get into that. But right now, if you were, you'd be a greaser. But you'd have like a heart of gold. Like, if someone fell down, you would help them up, but then if one of your cool friends came by, you would, like, make a joke about how they fell. I mean, yeah, I, I, I guess. I don't know. Activate the graveyard controls. And you think I'm a theater kid? My feelings are hurt. Oh, this is like... What's that one game? I. This is cool. Surprise, shorty. Surprise, shorty. <laughs> Find your way out of the graveyard. Wow, you read that so enthusiastically. <laughs> Search the maze for the nerds. This building is so cool. Oh, those eyes are moving. Oh. Is it like Halloween? No, because Halloween, we haven't been here a year. It's a carnival. Yeah, I know it's, it's a carnival, carnival, but is so it like... That's probably why they're doing like the fun house crazy maze. Yeah. Maybe they the do it year round. No, find Bucky. I don't remember which one was Bucky. Bucky... This guy's name is Fatty. Are you kidding me? Where are you going? I'm trying to find Bucky. Why didn't you go through? There was a door at the end yeah, of the Yeah, there hall. was a... I can't go through the door until I find Bucky. Mm. Listen, are, are we fighting? No. Do you are want we? to? <laughs> no, I'm really thinking oh. about the mac and cheese that I have and how there's leftover hot dogs. Fatty. And so I might... Maybe I'm Fatty. And I might cut up the hot dog and put it in the mac and cheese and throw some hot sauce in there. Anyway. Alright, I think I'm going the right way. I thought it, it really breaks immersion when there's a, you know, mini map. <laughs> yeah, it's not really a maze for us, is it? Oh my god. This thing is insane. How much money does this school have? This isn't the school. This is the town. Oh, the carnival. My bad. I'm still impressed. Da, 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 How is Jimmy, like, that good of a fighter? Because he doesn't really stand out much. He's not, like, big or... I don't know. Yeah. Why can't... No. Maybe hold down Y? Interesting. There we go. He wasn't dead. Er, uh, not dead, but he wasn't... Unconscious. Yeah. <laughs> dead in a PG way. <laughs> yeah, dead in a PG way. Unalive.
Yeah, give me the bat. There you go. I hope you can keep it the rest of this time. Boop. Mm, boom. Is the bat still there? I hope. Yeah, I can pick it back up. Hopefully. Yeah. Okay, good. It's a lot more fun than punching. This was fun. Yeah, this is a cool level. Dang. Give me your bet. He looks like Zac Efron in High School Musical. Are you saying he was a bully? It's the hair. What, you think I'm talking shit about Troy Bolton? Yeah. No, I was just commenting on their looks. Alright, I think that was all of them. Oh. And also, too, wait, the thinking about it, why is what was the fun house hitting people for and knocking them out? Like, this. That was us. No, I know. Deciding to use it that way. But, like, what's this fun house for then if that wasn't designed to. Okay, I don't even know what we just walked in on. <laughs> okay. That but, was Bucky? Yeah. Hmm. Not what I expected. Um. All right, now we gotta find Fatty. Oh, it's right there. Oh my God! Is he got moves? <laughs> oh, they just needed help out of the fun house. I I guess. What the heck? Oh, ooh. gross. We got the devil. Did Tyler ever tell you guys he's growing a horn? Oh yeah. <laughs> um. So on my face. Like my like literally like I'm growing a little devil horn, and, and Ella's like you should go get that checked out. And I'm like I've had it for literally my entire life, and yeah. she's like yeah you should go get it checked out. And I'm like, but feel free to lecture him in the comments about how important it is to take care of yourself and how if you catch something like a mass growing on your forehead, sooner is better than later. I mean yeah I mean when you put it like that yeah, but like. <laughs> Also, but it's my I horn. I don't want to. It's my horn. It's very on brand with my YouTube channel. I want you to get your priorities <laughs> straight. Huh? I want you to get your priorities straight. I don't have priorities. That, I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. Um. Oh. Uh, what to do? What to do? I'm leaving. I don't know what you're going to do. Oh, where are you going? Away. <laughs> oh, where to? Hmm? Where are you going? Oh, where to? I'm going to go hang out with someone who, who has priorities. Oh, like Steven. I didn't name any names. That was you. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I was just checking my phone to see if Steven was here. On hey, hey guys, if you guys follow her social media, keep a lookout for a guy named Steven because... um. You have my location. You don't need... Okay, but what if he's spots. coming to you? Oh, well, in that case. Hmm? But you never thought of that one. I live in a basement. Is that really a concern of yours? <laughs> um, Someone would what you really me. should be worried about is how good is the noise suppression down there? You're really concerned, aren't you? A little bit. I still remember the time that we took it so far, and I was like, can we please <laughs> stop doing that? Because now I'm starting to feel a certain type of way. One time, oh my gosh, I don't know. Tyler's gauge of like a woman dressing up is very different than like actually being dressed up. Like, dresses are the easiest outfit to wear because it's no pants, it's a whole outfit, you just throw it on. But one time, I took the trash out in a dress and I came back in when he was there and he thought I was coming back from like a date or something. But it was just a dress, it wasn't even like a night, it was like a cotton dress like i clean in the oh yeah dress and i was sometimes. just like sitting there i'm like huh where are you coming from I'm like, yeah. i took out the trash and that seems like the dumbest excuse ever not dumb if i've also been emotionally abused before and i overthink it no I but that overthinking has saved my life guys we have a lot of things we need to work through yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah. Don't look too cute while taking out the trash, okay, everybody? Apparently it's a crime. It is. And just so you know, 
Or if you're going to look cute, take out the trash. Just have your boyfriend do it. Because why are you getting your hands dirty, queen? I was. I, I thought you were gonna. I, I thought have... you were gonna enjoy that one. Uh, it seemed a little forced. What do you mean? But um, no, you're right. Like if I was gonna have a second boyfriend, and like if he's not even taking out the trash, like what's the point? You know? Yeah. All right. That's like next the time on Sinistre choice. plays. We are gonna do this mission, and yeah. Whatever this mission is. If you guys enjoy this series, make sure. No, it's a gun. Oh, right there? Yes. Yeah, it's a rat. No, it's a gun. I'm not stupid. <laughs> um. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment if you report down below. And tell me how you're... Tell me how you like the series so far. Too many rats, in my opinion. Oh, my God. Look how close that one is. All right, bye.